Paula, one of the data storage administrators, has been requested by the data privacy officer to complete a data assessment and cleanup effort in order to reduce risk of personal information being released. She begins by understanding and then filtering the data. Upon completing analysis, she takes action to manage the data, reducing risk to the business. Having indexed the data, Paula begins by reviewing all corporate data. This could be all data or a subset of data across multiple sources, including social communication sources. Visualizations assist in targeting additional analysis. Paula reviews the library of filters and selects the filter that will identify personal identifiable information, or PII, contained on an employee desktop. Knowing that this collection of information will be the target of her analysis, she creates a new personal desktop info set. Noting the reduced content, Paula reviews the resulting information and begins additional analysis. She creates a new filter targeting specific categories of personal information, such as credit card information and social security numbers. When creating a new filter, Paula has multiple filtering capabilities which she can add to the filter library upon completion. Having identified these exposures and wanting to take immediate action, Paula creates a new personal identification and financial information info set. After a quick review, she selects to act on this information. Paula takes action by moving it to a secure repository where additional analysis, such as discussions with the content owner, can be completed before the exposures are ultimately resolved. She selects to have this action take effect immediately in order to eliminate the risk of inadvertent release. Paula reviews details of the execution log and confirms that the action was completed and the content was secured with no exceptions. Upon completion of her analysis for sensitive personal information and to ensure accuracy and audit integrity, Paula validates all processes and actions that have been taken. She creates a final report of her activities and results and then emails the report to the data privacy officer for his records. Today we have seen how a data storage administrator was able to understand, analyze, and manage sensitive personal information in order to reduce risk from legacy data. For more information, please contact IBM. Thank you.